Six of the eight teams have already taken the field in 2022, but now it is time for the Coastal Cobras and Midwest Mallards to kick off their seasons, and we finally get to see the number one overall pick, Jordan Robles, make his MLW debut. Hello everybody, I'm Kyle Schultz alongside Tommy Cogman once again. We welcome you to the Meadows for the fourth matchup of the 2022 season and a 2017 World Series rematch between Tommy's Midwest Mallards and the Coastal Cobras. While that World Series was quite a few years ago now, I still think it weighs pretty heavily on Drew Davis's head. But we're focused on the present over here and uh, it's going to be quite the day here at the Meadows. Um, I am joined by Jordan Robles and Ben Wilson here, two new Mallards this season as we got Robles number one overall in the draft and then traded for Wilson in the offseason. We also have Brendan Davenport here who will be in the bullpen, but uh, once again, kind of a new look for the Mallards, but we needed it after going 4-11 last year, and uh, we're going to start on the right foot today. Looking at the Coastal Cobras, they have a full lineup here today. I'm talking Drew Davis, Sean Flynn, Andy Duran, Gus, Baranasi, and the rookie BN. I, I really do like the direction the Cobras are headed. I really like BN, young, solid arm that I think could see some innings today. So props to Drew for leading them in the right direction. But I'd say, honestly, most of the buzz is around Robles and the Mallards today. They're just such a new team. And um, what I really think it's going to come down to today is how quickly Robles is able to adjust. He's obviously an East Coast Swiffler. They play with big bats, um, further pitching distance, knife balls instead of scuff. So if I was to be completely honest, I think it's going to take him a game or two to get used to it. But at the end of the series, when he's, when he's accustomed to our playing style, I think the Mallards will be ready to go and could possibly steal this one from the Cobras. Yeah, he's a versatile player. I mean, I wouldn't have picked him if I didn't think he could adjust, so I have a lot of confidence in Jordan to start off strong today. And folks, just a final reminder that if you want to be a part of history and see the first ever MLW series in a professional stadium, we are only a few weeks away from our series at Fifth Third Field in Toledo, Ohio. That's on June 12th. All the event information and ticket information is in the first link in our description below. Hope to see a ton of you guys out there. Time now for the player interviews. All right, Jordan, how excited are you to finally be in MLW and play today against the Cobras? It's very surreal. You know, if someone told me a year ago that I'd be playing an MLW here at the Meadows, I would have laughed, but here I am. I'm very thankful and I'm happy to get it going. Drew Davis, how excited are you to be here and to face a Mallard team that you really don't know much about? What's the approach? Can you give me on a scale of 10, uh, out of what? One to 10. 18. Um, 18 level excitement, um, as you can tell by my voice. Um, and what was the other question? What's the approach? Just following the scouting report, uh, had a team meeting last night, went pretty swell. Ooh. And um... <laughs> All right, Mallard's covers, here we go. <laughs> Robles digs in. Mallard's Cobras, here we go. Let's go, Pat! <laughs> Great AB already. Watch it! Great eyes. He's on to lead off the game. Right down the pipe, strike three looking. Yeah! Here's Ben Wilson. Traded in the offseason. It is hit hard back to Barron. He's safe at first, I believe. Did he get him? He got him on the foot? Got him on the foot. All right, once again, no review needed. Look at the honesty from the players. Wilson said he got his foot. He's going to be out at first, moves Tommy up to second, and Robles is back up. What a pitch from Barron at 67. Ends the frame. Scoreless, bottom one. We've got Andy Duran leading off for the Cobras. Robles on the bump, here we go. Pitch to Duran. Riser got him swinging, strike three. One away. Drew batting in the two slot here today. Riser oh, to center oh, field! Oh. It's Wilson in left center. Robles took some off with the riser. Drew almost made him pay. <laughs> Jordan goes, I almost had a heart attack. Wilson at the deepest part of the park makes the grab. We've got two away. 3-1 count on, on Flinny. Low, good idea from Sean Flynn. Brings up Baranowski in the four slot. Riser didn't get all of it. It's Wilson again makes the play. Aside of the walk from Flynn, that's a very clean inning from Robles in his first outing at the Meadows. No, 
<laughs> Swing and miss on the riser. Cutting in on Tommy. On the drop ball. Baron changing it up. Two away. Let's go, Ken! Baron pitching really well here in the second. What a we got an automatic ball. That's going to be ball four. Baron fired up that last one. 74 on the gun. Previously in the inning, already threw a 73 mile per hour riser. So by rule, that's going to be an automatic ball and that happened on a full count pitch. Robles works another walk. Hey, yeah, it's ball, it's ball. Grounder, hard hit to the left side. It's going to be a single for Tom. First and second, a two out rally. Now it's B. Willie. What a pitch from Barron. Drop ball, strike three, look, and ends the inning. Zeros as we head to the bottom of the second. Cobes looking to strike first. This has got a big game atmosphere. Hit him. Oh, it doesn't matter. Ball four to Andy. <laughs> Lead off walk for the Cobras. Hard hit back to Jordan. Oh, he's there. Save it first, Drew slides in. Go, 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 go. And Andy's gonna score. The Cobras strike first. On a hard hit ball from Drew. Single, and he gets his second. Cobes lead it 1-0. Let's go, Andy. Tough play to make for Robles in the field. Add a little bit of Drew Davis speed, and that's a formula for a run. That's four. Flynn. Ball four to Flynn. First and second now, Baranowski. Strike three on Baranowski, but at 74, that's his first warning of the inning. One out, first and second for Durand. Fair ball back to Jordan. Tough hop again. Base is loaded for the Cobes. Andy gets a piece, makes it a single. And they're now loaded for Drew Davis. Fair ball to the right side. Robles makes the play. Two outs. Double play, got Andy. He wasn't running, I don't think he knew the situation. A double play, ends the inning. Jordan gets him. Oh man. A mind fart from Andy. And that's gonna end the inning. 2-0 as we head to the third. What a play. Oh, that's awesome. What is Andy doing? Jordan Robles hard hit to the left side, and it's going to be his first career hit in MLW. Jordan Robles is on base. Give him the ball. We want it. And that'll actually bring the tying run in Tommy Coughlin to the plate. Inside, Tommy Coughlin based on balls. Drew Davis calls time. They're going to have a mountain meeting. Drew shares his wise words, and Wilson digs in. Swing and a miss. Nice spot from Barron. Gets Wilson to chase. One way for Robles. With two guys on. He's the go-ahead run. Another mountain meeting. And Drew's pulling him. What? Oh my goodness. With one away, Drew's gonna enter the game. This could go a number of directions. To take Drew's side here, I'm thinking that he thinks Robles was seeing Baranowski well, wants to change it up, put in a new pitcher in a very dire situation. We shall see if it pays off. Here's Robles. Ball four, he walked him. Bases are loaded now for Tom. Outside ball four, the Mallards are on the board. 2-1 game in the third, and it's Wilson with one away. That's gonna be ball four. 
The ball game is tied. And it's Robles now. Here's the pitch. Inside, Robles with an RBI walk, and the Mallards have the lead. 3-2 in the third. What a rally this has been. Outside, 4-2 game. Another walk, Mallard score again. What a turn of events. 5-2 ball game. And they're gonna go to the rookie. Sawyer BN making his first appearance in MLW. This game is all over the place. Yeah. Tipped into the zone, strike three from Sawyer. Oh my goodness, three straight. Look at the movement on this drop off from Sawyer. Oh my goodness. That's honestly some of the most movement in the league. What a pitch from Sawyer! And he shows the emotion! We are gonna make that another pitch by pitch! What a performance! And it's only been two batters from Sawyer BN. That thing is coming down crazy. And you'd love to see the flare. Fits right in for the Cobras. And it's only a 5-2 game, bottom three. Back to Robles, snags it, the throw to first, got him! Flynn slips a little bit, and we've got one away in the third. Sean, that's why I got work, please. Here's BN, first career AB, that is. Swing and a miss, got him chasing. Two away in the third. Last chance for the Cobes. Swing and a miss, strike three. Robles gets him on strikes, and he's 1-0 in MLW. The Mallards take game one by a score of 5-2. This is a whole new ball club. They come back and get the victory. Game two coming up. Game two begins now. Robles is back on the bump. Strike three, got him on strikes. Hard hit to the right side. It's a single for Drew. Ball four to Sean Flynn, first and second. And it's gonna be Sawyer. Robles playing with that leg kick. Likes to throw off hitters. Spins. Riser into fair territory. Tommy at first, got him. He's gonna hold that three, second and third. Sawyer moves him up. Durand to left field, but right to Wilson makes the grab. Three outs. Cobes threaten, but don't score. Robles averse damage once again. Look at this, folks. Sawyer BN getting the start. The rookie already in game two. This has been a long AB. Darts into the ground. Robles with another walk. What a pitch from Sawyer, got him looking. This thing is coming down hard. What a pitch from Sawyer. Got him looking, strike three, two away. This is gonna be Brendan Davenport's first plate appearance in 2022. Oh, a knuckleball. That's a great AB from Davenport. Got two warnings already in the game. Hard hit, through the legs of BN. Base is loaded, Tommy's gonna stay at third. Could have stretched it. He won't, and the bases are loaded. Outside, Mallards lead at 1-0. In the first, they strike first. Slider got him swinging, strike three. The Mallards do score first though. BN battles back, and it's 1-0 as we head to the second. We get a shot, gone! Off the coping, then the scoreboard. Wilson ducks, and it's gonna be a home run. The first of the day for either squad. And it's Drew Davis. Look at the launch angle on this come run. So low to the ground, almost took Wilson's head off. 
And it's a tie ball game. Oh, that's gone! Swing and a miss. Nice pitch from Robles. Got him on strikes. Ooh, what a pitch. It's gonna be a walk for Durant. Took some off. Ball four. First and second for Flynn. What a pitch from Robles. Got him looking. Strike three. We head to the bottom of the second in a tie ball game. Drew ties it up with a solo shot, but Robles shuts it down later in the inning. Bottom two now we go. Outside, ball four. Robles chomping at the bit. Swinging a shot to left field. Out of second base, got him. Fielder's choice on the hard hit ball to left field from Robles. How about second base staying on the ground there? Shout out to our stakes. Oh, walked him first and second for Wilson. Oh, he got him, strike three. Moy Bien, Soy Bien with a crazy drop there. Inside, ball four, bases are loaded for Robles. Three, two count, bases loaded for Robles. Here's Bien. Low! The Mallards regain the lead. 2-1 in the second. And the ball is on our backstop. That's a glitch in the matrix. Swing a shot! Tommy Coughlin to left! That ball is gone! It's a grand slam for Tommy Coughlin! The first home run of 2022 for himself and the Mallards. And they break it open. Oh my goodness, a five slot in the inning, and they lead it 6-1. We are shot, Tommy Coughlin to left, that ball is gone! Looking strike three, Sawyer gets him, but not before Tommy breaks it open, 6-1 game. And folks, that's gonna bring us to the BL 101 trivia question of the day. The question is, who is the first out-of-state player ever selected in an MLW draft? That's right, it was Hayden Irwin in the 21 draft, drafted that number two overall. Hard hit to the right side. Tommy to Robles, got him at first. A ground out to lead off the third. That sleeve is always full. Schemes. Swing a shot to left field. Safe and first out of play. Andy almost runs the fence over and he's going to get second. Oh, swing and a miss on the slur. Slide drop action from Robles. And it's two away for Flynn. Here's the pitch from Jordan to Sean. Mallard's hyping him up. Swing a shot to right field. Tommy's under it. And he catches it! And the Mallards win the series already! They take the first two. They win game two by a score of six to one. Robles is 2-0 and on the mound, and they'll look to sweep the Cobras in game three coming up. All right, game three, here we go. Mallards will go for the sweep. There's not been a sweep yet in 2022. And the Cobras will look to notch their first win of the season. Inside, ball four. Robles, walk. Inside, ball four, first and second. Swing and a miss. On a riser inside, got him on strikes. Yeah. Swing and a miss. Check swing. Got him. Inside. 
and the bases are juiced for Tommy. Inside, he walked him. The Mallard scored. 1-0 in the first. Tommy's eighth RBI in the day that ties Alec Warda for the league lead already. Oh. Looking, got him, strike three. Barron escapes a bases loaded threat, however, the Mallards do push one across. They look to get it back here in the bottom frame. The time has come. Tommy Coughlin is returning to the mound in 2022, wearing the headband and all. Drew Davis, leadoff walk. What a pitch from Tommy on the slider, strike three. Shot to right, right to Robles, got him! Doubles him up at first! Another double play from Robles, his second of the day. Line out, steps on first. And folks, I'm not gonna lie, I got flashbacks there at the 2017 World Series, where Gabrico doubled off Marvin at second to win the World Series. We head to the second now in game three. Oh, Fair ball! Got him at first! He blocked the base path, but he had the ball. Baranowski's got that right, and he gets him at first. Oh, swing a shot! Jordan Robles! First career home run in MLW! A solo shot gives them a 2 0 lead in the second. You just knew he would come around. Pitching, hitting, he's got it all down. It really didn't take long, folks. Outside, ball four, Tommy works him for a walk. Popped into foul territory. He makes the play, he's gonna tag up. Did he get him at second? I think he got him. We've got players all out of the outfield saying out. The call is out on the field. A double play. Oh my goodness. The third double play of the day. Baranowski to Drew Davis. Double play. Slider, no. He left it. Ball four. Let's go! Turn a fair ball to left side fair. Andy Durant single. That one. And Andy's actually mic'd up. Let's head to that segment right now. Man, did I miss getting mic'd up. This is gonna be an inning, I'll tell you what. This is our game to win. You think there's a four-leaf clover in there? <laughs> nice. Ran out of gas today on the way here. I have to call my mom. None of my Cobra teammates would have helped me. All I could do is eat, drink my coffee and eat my bagel. He's out! He's out! Dan, is he out? Where's Dan? Is he out? I didn't see it. I'm what do you mean he didn't see? <laughs> you gotta be freaking kidding me. I'm speechless. If you think the Cobras care, we don't. Wait. We do? Wait. We care. We care. Man, I would love for a body to hit to me, Mallards. What's up? Get him! He's out! He's out! That's that can jam practice! First team all gritty. Here's what I'm offering. We're giving you a, we're giving you a draft pick. Yeah. Okay. You come with Cobras. <laughs> Actually, See? No, we'll trade we'll And Dan, Dan's also thinking about it. So if you guys both say yes, just think about it. Great trade offer. Dan's coming over, you're coming over. I'm LeBron, I'm forming a super team. Let's talk about our draft pick. Sawyer, dude's a stud. We call him the kid. Yeah. He's all right. Yeah. Wow, All right. Andy. Good after Drew. What? Oh. oh. <laughs> that is not a strike. It hit the ground. Do you see that? Come on. I got to look in the mirror and reflect on why I just swung at that. Oh, you want the pump? I'll give you the pump, Dan. Yep, <laughs> oh, 
Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Please, that one! Hey. Final words is hello, goodbye, good riddances, Cobras by 30. Outside, Flynn left it, and it's gonna be ball four, bases loaded for Drew Davis. To right, Coglin's got that one, makes the play. Runners hold, and it's gonna be Duran now. Swing and a miss on a slider inside, and he punts the bat. And it's two away now for Flynn. In the grass, the Cobras make it 2-1. And it's Drew Davis looking to tire go ahead in the bottom of the second. Drew is three for seven on the day with a home run. He's looked good. Coughlin looking to get out of the jam. Here we go. Here we go, big pitch. And it's a tie ball game. The Cobras knotted up at two. And it's Andy looking to push across the go-ahead run. Bang and a miss, he took some off. The slider at 62 miles per hour gets Duran. Leaves the bases loaded. And it's 2-2 going to the third. Swing and a miss on the riser, got him. Inside, wasn't that bad. Outside, walked him. First and second for Davenport. Swing and a miss. He got him on strikes, two away for Wilson. What a pitch from Baranowski. Locks in, gets strike three. And we head to the bottom of the third in a 2-2 ball game. They'll look to walk it off. Out of boy Baron, where to lock in? <laughs> Sweet a shot to the right side. It's Bear! Flynn's gonna stretch it and go to second. He's going three, but he slips. He's safe in second, though he gets back in time. It could have been a triple. But Flynn trips at second base, gets back in time. They have something going. Oh man, that was electric. Got a piece of ball. It's gonna move Flynn to third. He gets him at first. Hey, he does the job. Flynn's only 43 feet away from a win. It's Duran now. Anything in play should score the winning run. Ball four, it's first and third now. Watched it, ball four. Incredible eyes from Sean Flynn. Works him for the walk. And now it's one out, bases loaded for Drew Davis. Big pitch here. Swing and everything, got him up strikes. Two away for Duran. With the bases still loaded. Can Tommy lock in and get out of this? And force it to extras for the third straight week. Oh man. Oh man. Here we go. Swing and missing got on strikes. The Mallards get out of it. And we head to extras for the third consecutive week. Oh man, what a game three. What a job from Tommy. Watch it. Diane first to lead off the inning. Hands from Baranowski got him strike three. And the Cobes love it. This Cobe entourage is unmatched. Pitch from Baranowski, strike 
strike three. Sweet shot, Ben Wilson! That one is caught! Oh my goodness! Caught up in the wind or something. I thought that was a no-doubter. Drew comes up with it, and we head to the bottom of the fourth. A gust of wind at the perfect time. And we've got another Michigan State University College of Engineering pitching change. Robles comes in for Coughlin. The six inning eligibility rule only pertains to regulation innings, folks. And that's just shot to center field. Sean Flynn, we have single. Another change up and he got Drew swinging. Oh man, strike three. Swing and a miss, got him on strikes. Not a lot of confidence on that swing. Strike three, two away. Swing and shot, Sean Flynn walked up on run. And Wilson flies over the wall. The Cobras win game three. Oh man, he walks it off. To give the Cubs their first dub of 2022. He didn't have a dentist appointment today, but regardless, he gets the dub. Sean Flynn walks it off to end a crazy day of wiffle ball once again at the Meadows. Never a dull day. Mallards win the series 2-1. All right, boys, another wild day with ball. I'll go to Sean first, just had the walk-off home run. Just tell me what you saw there and what you're looking for and just how excited you were to uh, get one win on the day. Oh, uh, yeah, so uh, Robles was coming in fresh off the bench, and I was just getting used to Tommy, so I wasn't really too sure, but I think after seeing him for two full games, I, I knew what pitch I wanted, and it came to me, and I, I guess I just struck it well. And then Robles, two wins on the day, including a home run. How, how hard, first of all, was it to adjust to our, our playing style? But when, when you got accustomed, just yeah. how fun was it out, to be out there? It's awesome. It's definitely tough. Like, I'm not used to throwing, you know what I mean, this specific ball. But it, it's awesome. It's a fun time. And I got to get a lot better, obviously. And <laughs> so I'm looking to do that, looking to learn. So your beans nasty and <laughs> yeah, learn from everybody. So uh, it was a great day out here. And it was a lot of fun. And uh, thank you guys for watching, as always. Um, we really appreciate all the support in this first slate of games. Uh, you can subscribe in that corner to our channel and see the last video from us in that corner and our Twitch, podcast, Patreon, merchandise, tournaments. All those links are in the description. We'll see you next time.